In this lesson, we'll review a problem from the sentence completions. It's part of the critical reading. We're on page 475, question five out of five. So we know this is a difficult problem, but we've seen this a lot. The sentence is pretty short, but the vocab makes it tough. So before we begin, let's uh, find the key words. Here's the sentence. The judge's published opinions, though sophisticated and subtle, were undeniably blank. They left no doubt of her intentions. So here we've got contrast about the opinions. Though sophisticated and subtle, sort of insignificant, they were undeniably blank, so we want the opposite. And here's one more phrase that gives you definitive insight into the keywords. They left no doubt. So even though they were subtle, they were undeniably blank, the opposite of subtle, they left absolutely no doubt. So we're looking for a word, they were undeniably We'll just say absolute or undeniably certain, right? Without any doubt. All right, let's take a look at the answers and we're gonna work on some vocab and I'm gonna work backwards. E, ineffable. This means it is beyond words. Indescribable. Bubble. <laughs> or inexpressible. It can't be reduced to words. Sometimes you might see it in a sentence. Uh, the landscape is absolutely ineffable. It can't be described. That's not the answer choice. Tenuous. You hear this a lot with uh, arguments. If it's, a, if it's a tenuous argument, it's weak, it's unsubstantial, it's suspect or dubious, it is slight. All right, so it's a weak word and this is not the answer. We're looking for absolute or certain. Incorrigible. Here you hear this a lot with animals. It means incapable of being reformed. So cannot be trained or reformed. These habits are so ingrained they can't be changed. Usually bad habits. Another good word for sort of habitual is inveterate. Just cannot break that habit. Incorrigible not the answer choice. Effusive, now we've had words for talkative like garrulous and loquacious. This is similar but it means the person is just absolutely gushing and it usually deals with emotions so just cannot be restrained, gushing. And another good word is demonstrative, so showing excessive amount of emotion effusive again not absolute or certain the answer is a unequivocal let's start with equivocal to equivocate is to evade the truth to be ambiguous sort of like a double speak it's it's to somehow mislead to not be clear and truthful but if something is unequivocal it is an absolute certainty. It is incontrovertible. It is a fact. And that's exactly what no doubt means. Absolute and certain, unequivocal. And by the way, you may know there's a rock band. They were popular in like the early 2000s and the late 90s, no doubt. I wonder if... Uh, it's considering changing its name to unequivocal. <laughs> Probably not. All right, the answer here is A. See you next time. Thanks for watching.